Good afternoon, everybody. It's 4.27 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, March 3rd, 2020. Uh, <clears throat> I've been away for a while, and I think it's about time I make another video. I'm going to try to piece this together and show people how to use uh, what I found and exploit it. Let's just fix some things here. Okay. Now the first thing you guys are going to realize, I found out during an investigation with the New York Department of Financial Services that there was two trades in hand manipulating the order book. Those two trades are the same size, market size on the volume to sell. Those two trades actually belong to the market maker. And I found out on Coinbase Pro, on the LTC market, that the market maker himself is manipulating the price of Litecoin. And you can see my evidence is here. You can read this document. This is from the investigation I launched with the New York Department of Financial Services. You can read it here. If you have a good reading comprehension, you'll see where I derived my math from and how I was able to figure this all out. Okay, so now let's go back and check the market makers trades and I'll show you them. Now, the market maker in this case is putting up two trades, one on the buy and one on the sell side. So what he's doing is called boxing. You can read it here. Boxing is the heart of market manipulation where the same trader puts a buy in the sell and he controls the price and forces the mid-market price between the two largest trades in the order book, which are the market makers. Now let's show you how I find the market makers trades. Uh, you're going to look for two uh, trades that are the same market size. It might take a bit. And 2384.42. Twenty-three eighty-four forty-two. That was pretty easy. So those are the market makers' trades. Now you want to see the proof that he's manipulating the market. Those trades have to be equidistance. And what I mean, what we mean by equidistance is one: if the sell is uh, thirty cents above it, the buy has to be thirty percent below the mid-market price. Unfortunately. It's not because the market makers is manipulating the price, and, and you just do it as the 60 spot, the 60 times 60 dollars and six cents. Very easy to find. Now you could see. The buy is 54 cents away from the mid-market price, and the sell is 37 cents away, which means he has the market set to go down. He's, he's trying to bring the price down. So in this case, we know we'd have to wait to uh, take advantage of the exploit by waiting for the actual price to go down. Now wouldn't be the time to buy. Now how do I figure out... Uh, how he's going how far he's going to drop it or if he's going to continue to drop it now we know that it's in the state that he ha he set it up to drop you go down here use the to uh, stochastic rsi in this case this is the four hour he hasn't reached the bottom i think he's going to go down here so the price is going to significantly go down probably lower than 56 possible as you can see, he's been steadily bringing it down from 84.45. He's bringing it down. This is being manipulated down. This has nothing to do with the coronavirus. Okay. And then you want to check your one hour. It's bounced, but I think it's going to go back down more. So far, it's been going up nice on the one hour. But now it looks like he's, he wants to bring it down more because it's been set up that way by the calculations. And what they're doing here, the market maker's cross-trading, he's boxing, and he's 
excessive spreads between the bid and the ask prices because this bid and ask prices are in equidistance. One set further away than the other one. That means he's increasing his spread of what he buys and sells. So it's that easy, people. Uh, my channel it is it, it, the views have taken off. Though I have 500 and only 70 subscribers, uh, these two views I, I actually been posting these up. Everybody's watching these two videos here. This one's got over 800 views and it's still going. Okay. Now we're at 807. Probably going to hit 1,000 soon enough. So people are spreading this. Uh, the other one that's after it, which is also... It's heading towards 600 easy. Afternoon, everybody. So you can see people are watching my videos. They have learning. I'm trying to tell people they can exploit this. Quite possibly you can make money off of this. Because you can actually detect what the market maker is doing now. Whether he's bringing the price up or down. In this case, the sell is much closer than the buy. Which means he's going to attempt to bring the price down. You can actually track what the market maker is doing. In this case, it's clear as, as day from, from not only myself, but several other people have checked this, that the market makers is manipulating the price of Litecoin. Coinbase knows this. Charlie Leeds knows this. This is nothing short of a criminal enterprise, which is in operation here now, where they openly manipulate the market. And then they taunt investors to come in. And then what happens to the investor? He gets robbed. So that's the best I can show you people. Everything is here now. It's clear as day. I, I, I got it all soup to nuts. Uh, people are still watching those two key videos. <clears throat> Since uh, those people came in and revamped my channel and they set me up. My views on these two people are just kind I don't know what, who's sharing them. But it's going all over the place. We're up to 800 views. This is going to easily hit 1,000. So, we're winning the war. They lost. They tried to get my channel shut down. And my views have gone up. It's backfired. Everybody knows about this. It's too late for them. You can see here. They can't disprove it. The, the most they could do now, these Litecoin uh, Foundation Goon Squad could do now is just downvote. Because they really don't have any math or anything to dispute it. They're... they're, they're Long in breath and short on brains. So, so here it is. Everything here, the cross trading, the boxing. You can see it. Excessive spreads. So there you go, people. That's all I got. Uh, as far as uh. The agencies that are investigating it, it's just a matter of time. So they can gloat and feel proud of themselves why why the going's good. But it's gonna get bad very soon. So right now I hope you guys are enjoying your vacations with the money that you ripped helped ripped off. I hope you had a good time with that. Because your next vacation is gonna be to to the bars of a prison. Alright, people, I'm out. Be careful, don't let them rob you.